This is Daryl Scott. The knowledge tip today is about Acumatica attributes. Acumatica attributes are user defined and allow you to store additional properties for different entities in Acumatica. Attributes are defined at the class level, which allows you to collect different information for different classes of the same entity. Here is a list of the entities that allow attributes to be assigned. There are five different types of attributes allowed in Acumatica. An empty text box which allows you to fill in any value, a combo box which allows you to select from a list, a combo box that allows you to select multiple entries from the list, a check box which allows yes no answers, and a date selector. Let's look at attributes in Acumatica. Under Configuration, Common Settings, we find attributes. Attributes have a, an ID, a description, and a control type. Depending on the control type, you may have values which are used in the combo box, multi-select combo box. Let's add a new attribute. We enter an ID, a description, and select the control type. The combo box allows us to enter values. and we can change the sort order. Now we will add this attribute to an entity, in this case customers. Looking at this customer we select to edit the customer class. Here we have attributes that are already assigned to the class and we add our new attribute. Here we can also order the attributes on the list for this vendor cla customer class. And now when we refresh and look at the attribute list, we see that we have our values in the order we sele selected. Let's look briefly at the other entities that allow attributes to be assigned. As we've seen, we have attributes for customers and vendors, for employees, for stock and non-stock items, for projects, for project tasks, for account groups that are used in project management, for equipment, for business accounts, in this case for prospects, for leads, for contacts, for opportunities, and for cases. In addition to entering attributes into the system, we also have flexibility in reporting the attributes and getting them out of the system. We can use generic inquiries and the report designer. The generic inquiries allow us to add attribute columns to our listings. In Report Designer, similarly, we have access to our attributes and see that our system is reporting color on our physical count tags. Attributes in Acumatica provide a powerful, highly flexible method of tailoring the system to meet your needs. If you have a suggestion for an Acumatica tip you would like to see, please send me an email at dscott.com at cs3technology.com.